Hello, this is Veteran0121, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy X. And in this episode here, we're going to be exploring down here in the, whatever this is called, the Gorge Bottom. And, uh, yeah, let's head over this way first. Talk to this guy, I guess. Oh, alright. Oh, that's too bad. Alright. We have a new enemy here. Well, a couple new enemies. I think mech scouters are new, but... Yeah, we got an epodge. And they're not too difficult. I don't think there's anything too special about them. Other than they use physical attacks, which, well, isn't that special, actually. And we can steal high potions, yay! If you care. Oh, and they can poison you too. Lovely. Uh, yeah, let's go with Waka. And one physical attack should take him out easy enough. Yeah, I'm not going to be capturing any enemies unless they're like really rare <laughs> for a while, so yeah. Alright, we can get Mega Potion from that battle. Not bad, I guess. And over here. Oh, there's a sword in the ground. Alright, we obtained the Rusty Sword. That will be useful later on. Summoner Yokan once trained in this land. We Crusaders also intend to train here to challenge Sin once again. Uh, okay. And is this the same freaking battle? Okay. Anyways, is there anything over there? No. Okay, I'll, I'll backtrack to the uh, entrance of that cave or whatever it was then. Okay, we are at a battle? Come on, game. Really? Jesus. Huh. Yeah, one more step. And we have the cutscene. Love how the game does that. Where are we? It seems to happen to me a lot in these games. Faith is inside. As are the fiends. <gasps> hey. This where hmm. Where? What? The summoner I guarded on my first pilgrimage died here. Hmm. Yuna, let's go. The faith awaits. Will do. Okay, and we are in the Cavern of the Stolen Faith. And as you can see, there's a teleporter there that we can't use right now. Um, yeah, there's a lot of new enemies in this area, of course. Alright, here's one of them. It is a Yaoi. And I'm about to give them Owies. And I believe they can stone you with their physical attacks. Let's 
guess soft potions are kind of crap for stealing, but oh well. And do these guys have any elemental weaknesses? Okay, they are weak to ice. Wow, oh, and it, they don't do that much damage either. Easy enough. Alright, let's keep going. Alright, another new enemy in here. We have an Imp. And yeah, I think he likes to use lightning attacks. Nothing too crazy though. with a little Fundaga on this thing. Yeah. And what can we actually steal from these things? Maybe lightning gems? Yeah, okay. Ooh, Thundaga. Ah, that kind of hurt a little bit. You bastard with your lightning. Goodbye. Alright, let's keep going. And down here, I think we can find a chest. And okay, this guy. This guy is just stupid. Yeah, basically all this guy is is Come out and fight like a man. Yeah, no shit. Yeah, this guy's a magic urn. You can choose like a whole bunch of different targets on this thing. And if you hit the right one, you can get a prize or an item or whatever. Usually it's not a very good item, but if you guess wrong, then he'll do like a really powerful attack on all your party members so what I do against these guys I just run it's not worth fighting them it's really not and okay over here we get a chest and yeah it's a mega elixir I think we can actually encounter a rare rarer enemy in this intersection or in this dead end back here oh okay well Maybe not this time, but we do have some new enemies, or new enemy, Valhalla, or, v or Valaha, or whatever, however, however you pronounce it. <coughs> and, yep. Whatever, I'll just have Waka do Sentinel, Orn do Physical Attacks. Yeah, Sentinel again, I guess, whatever. Let's see what this guy can, uh can steal. Oh, high potions again? Come on, game. Really? Give me some better stuff. I'm sick of getting high potions. Eh, whatever. Riku. And farewell. And I'll just keep fighting around this area until I encounter that rare enemy I was talking about. Okay, we have some more new enemies here. We have a Needhog, a Dark Element, 
Well, yeah, just a dark element. Yeah, and these guys like to cast Reflect on themselves. And they have no elemental weaknesses. So yeah, basically your strongest spells you want to use against these guys. And yeah, just get his Staga going. And of course Sentinel. And I think you can actually steal Silver Hourglasses from these guys. Okay, maybe it's a rare steal. Whatever. Um, yeah. And what can we steal from these? Shining Thorns. Okay, I forgot what those actually do, but whatever. I'll have to look that up. And... Yeah, these guys are semi-rare. I guess. Um, yeah, I'll just uh, cast Holy on these things. They should be pretty easy to take out. Yes, and they like to cast Reflect on themselves, which kind of sucks, actually. Man, whatever, I'll just take that guy out easy enough. And then I'll just cast Reflect on Orin. Yeah, get that little... You can tell I've never used Reflect before. <laughs> uh, yeah. And then I'll just bring Lulu into battle. <coughs> and... Bounce Holy off of Orin. And there you go. Never did bother capturing that Nidhogg, did I? Oh well. No big deal. Okay, some more new enemies while I was running around. Okay, we have a Thorn here, and yeah, these guys like to use Pollen, which induces the sleep status and darkness, apparently, so yeah. And they are weak to fire. So, easy enough, I'll just uh, get a different character in here. And I think you can steal silence grenades from these guys, if I'm not mistaken. I don't know, we'll find out right now. Yeah, yeah, okay. Go with Kamari. And Waka. And I might as well capture one of these, I guess. Why not? And actually, I checked my timer, and I realized I'm out of time. So that's all for this episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy X. In the next episode, we will continue exploring the Cavern of the Stolen Faith and find out what's supposed to be here. I mean, it's pretty obvious. It's a freaking Aeon. Um, also, before I might as well mention it now. Yeah, make sure you have at least 200,000... Or wait, 205,000 gil before you enter this... Uh, this cavern, because that's the amount of gill you're going to need in order to get this Aeon. And yeah, that's it. And this is Veteran0121, and I'll see you next time.